Good day to every one of you. I'm so glad that you tune in to watch this mission video that we are about to show you. As the beginning of our endeavours overseas into missions, we actually went into the land of the Philippines. And over the years, as we have gone in to do work, uh, ministry work as well as mission work over the, this period of time, uh, you know, it was difficult for us to be able to uh, report results on a yearly basis. However, the video that we are about to show you documents the beginning of the program that we have done in the Philippines, running the Adopt the Ch Children to School program. And following the, that program, we are now also featuring the poorest of the poor program in which we are praying that God will raise more and more disciples. So Lord, grant us that wisdom and that grace to continue this work. So I present to you the program of the summary of the work in the Philippines. Sit back and enjoy. Greetings from Samal Island, Philippines. I am Angela Bruins Fernandez, Executive Director of FGC Community Link Incorporated. We are grateful to God that X program has been successfully maintaining for 15 years amongst the chosen poor students from five high school, two elementary school, and one university. Through X, we were involved closely with the principals, students, and parents of each school, and the program shared great valuable lessons to help students enhance their values and families to progress fostering close relationships to lessen family problems. Over the last 15 years, we have had 1,000 students and families who passed through our program and are now successful in different aspects of their life, including going to church. Some are now pastors, some engineers, teachers, and other professionals, including two which has been sent as missionaries to FGC Community Link, Cambodia. In October 2018, I had a prompting to go back to FGC's main vision to reach the poorest students throughout Samal Island through the Poorest of the Poor program, which is known as POPP. This means going to deeper and rougher places so hopeless students can have a life change and finish school with minimal support. The POPP is divided into two purposes. One is to partner with churches as a form of church growth support, giving the pastors an opportunity to visit and make Jesus known to the young people and to their families. Two, reaching the inner schools who lack stakeholders to support their poor students and motivate them to study in spite of poverty. Being part of the program also enhances the student's value system and help parents foster close relationship with school heads and teachers. The POPP program has been running for a year now and I will pass on to Ms. Ali Toriano, ex-executive, to give you the updates. When we started the Poorest of the Poor program, we initially had five stations, one school, and four churches. We were also able to sponsor 91 students. Legal Four Square Gospel Church had 18 families under the care of Pastor Thelma Okun with the assistance of her daughter, Miss Jacqueline Okun. Gillon Four Square Gospel Church had 15 students managed by Pastor Jenafe Puntungan. Del Monte Four Square Gospel Church had 18 recipients mentored by Pastor Sonia Santillan. The Liquid One Way Outreach also had 20 beneficiaries under Pastor Roland Saavedra. And on the now elementary school had 20 scholars catered by Mrs. Evelyn Pasana. Miss Jacqueline Okon of Likup Church as well as Mrs. Evelyn Pasana of Ondanao Elementary School are going to share to us the positive result of having this POPP in their respective stations. Since 
FGC Community Link Incorporated offered Likob Foursquare Gospel Church the Poorest of the Poor program on October 2018. We would like to thank God that our church experienced church growth through this program. Ever since we gather the children to be selected, God had led us to choose 18 out of 25 deserving students. Those who was chosen had shown interest and improvement in joining the mentoring every Saturday. We have seen these progresses happening in the last year. They have been attending Sunday service with their siblings and some parents. They invited their friends and classmates to join the mentoring session every Saturday and Sunday. They were enthusiastic participating in church activities like dancing, singing, and playing instruments. All of them accepted Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior. Now, five of the parents are already members of our church since it started the program. So we will continue to pray that God will grow these children and the families to be strong in Him. Once again, FJC, JB, thank you for all your support to FGC Community Link Samal. God bless you. Aundanao Elementary School is grateful to be selected as one of the recipients of the Poorest of the Poor program. As a school, this program has enabled me to be in closer touch with the students and parents in the program. The lessons discussions with the students and parents help me observe the changes in the values of the students. They are no longer shy. Most of them are keen to study and motivated to improve their grades. Meeting with the parents have caused greater bonding and cooperation with the school activities. Kudos POPP. May more children, more schools, more parents will benefit through this program. I would like to thank FGCCL Incorporated director for bringing this program to our school, for the FGCCL staff who is leading and guiding us, and our salute to all sponsors who are involved in giving hope to the kids and parents to see the importance of education. <music>